One of the greatest challenges for humanity is to produce sufficient food, feed, fiber and biofuel, while at the same time adapting to climate change, reducing agriculture's environmental footprint and addressing labor shortages. These challenges require new ways of thinking. Smart technologies can enable innovative approaches. With an interdisciplinary team, Phenorob conducts world-leading research in robotics and phenotyping for sustainable crop production. Our vision is to transform crop production by optimizing breeding and farm management through the development and application of new technologies. To reach the vision, we need to solve multiple research gaps. In the paper, we distinguish research gaps around monitoring, modeling, decision-making and uptake. Consider weeding as an example to illustrate these areas. We need technology for monitoring that can detect the weed and the status of the surrounding crops. We need modeling that uses the information we gather to predict the yield impact or the ecological effect of leaving the weed on the field. Building on monitoring and modeling, we need to be able to make decisions. In this example, we need to weigh the yield loss against the ecological effects and the cost of removing the weed. Once we reach a decision, we need a robot that can execute it. Finally, we need the right incentives for uptake, for example, policies that compensate farmers for the ecological benefits of leaving weeds on the field. Closing the research gaps around these topics requires a strong interdisciplinary collaboration between plant and agricultural science, computer science, ecology, economy, robotics and geodesy. However, this is easier said than done. Based on our experience from our own large-scale interdisciplinary research project Phenorop, Robotics and Phenotyping Towards Sustainable Crop Production, we propose several measures to foster and enable this interdisciplinarity. Central elements are core experimental platforms, which could be agricultural field and landscape experiments of different spatial and temporal scales and foci. These provide a collaboration and communication environment for researchers from different disciplines. Other examples a seminar and lecture series and interdisciplinary undergraduate and graduate teaching activities which are very important for the development of a common language. We can already partially address these gaps on Phenorop. One example are robotic technologies for weed detection and removal. We develop agricultural robots which are equipped with different actuators that are able to detect single weed plants and crops and to execute the treatments only where needed. Additionally, we are able to give those weeds, which are beneficial as pollinator fodder, an ecologic value, detect and identify them, and leave them in the field. In this paper, we show how Phenorop addresses real-world problems with a technology-oriented approach.